The next time you sit down to game on your Xbox, it makes sense if you wanted to use your Bluetooth headphones or wireless earbuds to listen to your game and chat with your teammates. However, Microsoft doesn't allow a direct Bluetooth connection. But that's where this little guy comes in. This $30 adapter makes it easy to connect any pair of Bluetooth headphones or earbuds to your Xbox. I'm Jason Cipriani and in this ZDNet video, I'm gonna walk you through how to set up this little adapter and use any Bluetooth earbuds with your Xbox. So Microsoft doesn't rely on Bluetooth connections for like controllers or its own headset to communicate with your Xbox. So it doesn't allow you to use, like I said, these Pixel Buds Pro to directly connect them to your Xbox and use the microphone as well as the audio portion to game with friends or just listen to your game audio in general. So you have a couple options. Either you buy a Microsoft specific headset or an Xbox specific headset, compatible headset, that will interact with Microsoft's own version of Bluetooth connectivity for the Xbox. Or you could go on Amazon and if you do enough digging and searching, you'll find something like this. Right now, this is the UberWith Bluetooth Xbox One transmitter dongle for stereo headset audio adapter. It's basically a Bluetooth transmitter that connects to your Xbox controller, which then in turn connects to your Bluetooth headphones or earbuds and allows you to listen to your game. And I'll get to some of the nuances and, and caveats of what this adapter does. I'm looking at the listing right now on Amazon. It's listed for $29.99. When I bought it, it was actually like $35, $36. So it's gonna fluctuate there, but for under, let's say $40, you're gonna get a, an adapter like this one. So the adapter itself in the box comes with a micro USB cable that you need to charge the adapter. Uh, it has about 10 hours of battery life. There's a couple of buttons on here. And what you'll do is with a compatible controller. So this one is the new Xbox controllers, the more recent Xbox controllers is what it'll work with. Although I have been able to get it to kind of finagle it in and get it to work with the Elite 2 controller. Uh, however, it works better with the more modern and current controller. So what it does is it actually plugs into the bottom, 3.5 millimeter audio jack, adds a little bit of weight to your controller, but not a whole lot, right? It's still there. Um, and it sits in, you're able to game, doesn't do a whole lot there. But what you'll need to do to pair it with your headphones, this particular dongle, and there's a few other ones listed on Amazon. I can only speak to this one because it's the one I've tested, is you'll power it on and you'll put it in pairing mode. Here's the problem. There's no display on this for you to select which headphones or earbuds you want to pair with. So what you'll need to do is make sure there's no other earbuds nearby in pairing mode. Odds are there aren't, but double check. Um, and then you'll, I have the Pixel Buds Pro here. What you'll do is you'll put this in pairing mode by holding the button in for a few seconds. There's instructions in the box. Then you'll put your earbuds or your headphones in pairing mode. And within about 10 seconds or so, this dongle will find headphones that are in pairing mode and automatically connect. It took me a few tries to get them to connect. I didn't get the timing right. And there were some instances there where it just wasn't working. But eventually, once I got them to connect, I was able to put in the Pixel Buds Pro and listen to the audio of my game. Now notice, I said listen, because the microphone portion of the audio from the Pixel Buds Pro or any wireless earbuds using an adapter like this will not work. Instead, there is a microphone built into the adapter itself. I don't know if you guys can see that at the bottom. Um, that picks up any audio that you transmit or say. So if you're talking to teammates in, in Call of Duty, Warzone, or Fortnite, or whatever it is, this is where your audio is gonna come from. There's a big downside to this. That means the audio of you clicking buttons and moving the joystick, that's also gonna get picked up by this microphone, which is gonna be really annoying for your teammates. So this isn't the ideal solution for using Bluetooth headphones, but honestly, it's the best solution there is. There's all the other adapters I found use the same microphone built into the, the adapter itself. It's gonna pick up the same audio. 
think of this as more of a solution for single player games. If you're an adventure game and you're roaming around on your own, Hogwarts Legacy, great game. That's a good example. Uh, multiplayer games, you probably annoy your teammates with all the clicking, but I've heard some pretty annoying people with music blasting in the background on games as well. So really pick or choose which one you want. For under $40, this solves the, the problem of not being able to use any Bluetooth headphones with your Xbox. And what more can you really ask for? One other thing. There is a switch on the bottom of the adapter that you can mute the microphone and not use it at all if you'd rather just play silent. So there is a fix there, not ideal, but it is what it is, right? All right, so that's a quick way of connecting any Bluetooth headphones or earbuds to your Xbox. It's not ideal, like I said, but it works. And it's a solution for under $40. I'm Jason Cipriani with ZDNet. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to check out ZDNet.com for more tips like this one, as well as reviews and all the latest tech news.